Okay, so here we have a typical Samsonite suitcase lock. And you'll see this is actually still attached to the suitcase. And in this case the combination is set to 000, which is the default for most Samsonite and American Traveller locks. And you'll see this opens fine as it is on that combination. And if I change the combination, it now doesn't open. So let me change it back to 000. And now with the case lock open, on the back of the lock, this particular one has a little knob. You push it downwards, and this will allow you to reset the combination. Now just so that I can't see the combination it's being reset to, I'll put my hand over the top, and now I'll pull that knob back upwards, and spin the dials again so I can't see them. So I now have no idea what the combination for this suitcase is. Which if I didn't know how to pick the lock, that wouldn't be very useful. So what I'm going to do now is I reposition myself so I can actually see down here and I'm looking underneath the lock wheels. Now this might be slightly difficult for you to see but what I'm actually looking for is I'm looking for where there is a hollow in each of the wheels. And if I rotate them round, now you can either do this by eye or you can do it with a, a small piece of metal or plastic or something you can push in there to do it by feel. Um, in this case I'm doing it by eye. And then when you find all three of them and you get them lined up, you're then exactly, the wheels are in the right position, but you're five digits away. So one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And hey presto, the lock's open. And the combination was five, nine, six.